Yo, it's Prime Playboys. Welcome back to another video. Actually, to another banger video. Um, in today's video, man, I'm just going to be cleaning up Dusty. Also, I have a new GoPro attachment that I'm going to be trying out. And we're going to be seeing how we like that. Hopefully, the audio will sound better. Um, just because the GoPro literally is going to be sitting like right here in my face. So, hopefully, it sounds good. But also, I wanted to tell you guys that I, re I, I didn't relocate the battery. I had somebody else named Dio. Um, I put his at name right here. He relocated my battery to the trunk As you guys can see so now the engine bay has so much freaking space you guys Like look at this you guys look at all the dang space, bro It is crazy, bro So now we get to clean up a whole bunch of stuff make stuff sound nicer not sound nicer But look nicer. I finally get to fix this clunking issue that I keep hearing because I'm able to see now and uh yeah man we should be we should be good bro like look over the space I get to clean up my piping because this looks terrible and that's from it just hitting the battery tray dang this was pretty deep but yeah I get to clean up the piping um yeah bro hopefully everything looks pretty solid after I finish but uh today we're gonna be cleaning up the engine bay as well not like a major cleanup but just like wiping down things I'll probably remove my cash can uh i'm gonna take this out and put the little plug in that i have for it and yeah that's really it guys if you guys see my setup or been following me for the longest you guys know i like to clean i like to keep my engine base super super clean and the way it's looking now is it's terrible i actually hate it so much like every time i pop the hood i get mad because of how filthy it is but to other people when they see it they're like yo it's not that bad but to me I like to clean myself like really I like to keep my stuff like really really clean. Also, I can't wait till I swap out this valve cover because this valve cover is it's poots. It's poots. It look trash. And yeah, man. So let me start rambling on and let's get to uh removing this battery because I have to uh swap it out because this battery is not the battery that I want to run. This is a Walmart battery. Now there's nothing wrong with the battery. Um it's just that's from Walmart and plus I don't like so like if anything happens i don't want no vapor battery vapor inside my car because that's really really toxic and uh yeah so we're gonna be swapping this out for a ag ag agm battery which is like a whole different type of battery and uh it doesn't pro it doesn't produce harm harmful uh fumes like what these lead batteries do so yeah let's swap it out get the new one installed and yeah clean up the engine bay clean up dusty and probably go for some little pools because I kind of want to see what this GoPro like view looks like. Five minutes later. All right, guys, let's go swap out this uh, battery for a. Uh... Damn! Damn! What I was trying to say, look, my camera came in focus. What I was trying to say is, let's go swap out this battery for a uh, AGM battery, cause yeah. But then I dropped my camera and said, "Damn." But uh, yeah, let's go do that real quick. All right, guys. So I got the new battery in. Um, I went with a Die Hard uh, Platinum, which is an AGM battery. Um, as you guys can see, it's made for these vehicles right here. You feel me? Uh, on the Civic Side, uh, uh, Ram TRX, and uh, what I want to call this? What's the fast? A Durango Hellcat. Who? But uh, yeah, the reason why you guys see the old bracket back in the car is because. I'm not gonna lie, this new bracket I got sucks. Like, this crap is terrible, bro. Like, goodness. But yeah, so I had to throw the old bracket on. Um, I'm most definitely gonna order like a better looking version of this so I could tie it back down, but it, it moves, but not crazy amount. I just need a better battery tray as well. But uh, probably gonna tighten it down a little bit more so it doesn't wiggle like this. But it's it's good for right now um yeah it sucks that this battery tray is so terrible i didn't know it's gonna be like this thin piece of plastic but uh yeah it's nothing that i can't replace Whew. 
all right man well what's up you guys it's been a couple days since i did uh well not did but a couple days since i ended off that last clip and i remember i told you guys i wanted to do some quick pulls to see how this gopro is looking how this new view pov view is looking and from what i'm seeing it look pretty damn badass because i kind of can see it not, not like fully can see it So yeah, we're gonna give this new setup a shot. <laughs> we'll give this new setup a shot. Um, we're gonna see how how like I guess bad it is and how good it is. I can see perfectly fine. Now, do I feel like an idiot driving like this? Yeah, kind of, because I feel like I look like one too. But uh, what works works, bro. And um, I can see perfectly fine. And if I can't see, I just adjust the hat a little bit more like I'm about to do right now. Cause it's kind of sitting a little bit too low on my face. Get over this turn real quick. Like right here, I'm guessing should be fine. Just this. See what that angle look like. Yeah, bro. I can see perfectly fine. You guys probably get some racing videos of me driving like this or with the GoPro being right here.